Go ahead if you're ready. Okay, hey, Trayvon, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. What got you guys through this? You know, there were a lot of situations where you were in a really tough spot there, and uh, how were you able to have an answer for everything you needed every time you needed it there at the end? Uh, it simply came down to trusting each other, you know, um, getting stops. You know, they, they hit a lot of threes. Um, obviously, you know, teams shoot different at home. You know, they, they shot totally different from when they shot at our place. So, uh, you know, we was kind of late getting, getting out to guys. Um, we, uh, we, we had a goal going into the game. You know, we wanted to shut uh, arms down. You know, usually when he's involved, you know, Coach talked about, you know, how much of a, a boost he gives his team. So, um, yeah, we, we came in with the mindset to kind of shut those shooters down. Um, but, you know, obviously we were, we were a little late, you know, getting out to shooters. Um, and we just cleaned it up in the second half. You know, they came down to rebounding and stuff like that. So, Right. Just the shot Jaden made, I mean – you guys have seen his confidence. You've seen his work ethic. How much does it mean to you to see him, you know, see that effort rewarded in a situation like that? I mean, he, he deserves it. You know, nobody, nobody deserves it more than him. Man. He's been putting in, you know, countless hours in the gym. Um, you know, anytime you ask for Jaden, you know, he's, he's in the gym somewhere shooting. So, um, you know, he, nobody deserves it more than him. So. Uh, obviously, you coming back from only playing six minutes in the first half, you uh, made a lot of big plays during the second. Just uh, – what was working for you there when you guys needed buckets and you were able to get them? Uh, just playing through it, you know, early on. Um, you know, I think I, uh, Purdue as a team, you know, all of us together have to be better with, like, playing through calls. You know, we can't rely on the refs. And, you know, that's something I was doing the first half, uh, just looking to the refs. And that's something I don't usually do. But, um, you know, they are a very aggressive team. So, you know, at some point, you know, the foul has to be called. But, um you know, we all we just have to do a better job overall. Just not looking for calls, playing through it, you know, like we talked. Do you feel like everything's coming together for you guys right now? I mean, during this four-game winning streak, you kind um, of feel they, yourselves they, getting better and better, and stuff definitely. like that, getting closer together. I mean, just not never satisfied. You know, it is we definitely coming together. Uh, but, you know, we we don't want to settle. You know, we want to keep getting better, keep building every day. So. Uh, I'm good. Thank you, Travion. You. Mike Carmen, please. Travion, just kind of your your view of uh, Jaden's last second shot and kind of what was going through your mind when he he stepped back there. I uh, mean, like I said, he, nobody deserved that more than him. Um, you know, before before he went out there, you know, uh, you know Jaden was trying to you know find his rhythm. You know, and I put him to the side. I said, Jaden, you know, when you play for us and you listen to us, um, you know, you're going to be successful. You know, he, he trusted us, um, and you know, it, it worked out in his favor. So. I mean, um, is do you do you view him as an emotional guy? Very, I mean, very. He's he's very passionate about the game. Um, you know, he like I said, he puts in countless hours. So you know, obviously, he wants to get some out of that. And then, you know, him him being a freshman, you know, he's still looking for his rhythm. So um, he's he's definitely really emotional. You know, similar to how I was. You know, I I don't show everybody, but. Um, you know, when I was a freshman, you know, I was I was really emotional because you know when you're coming in, you know, you want to play super bad, and you know, you're trying to find minutes. It's, it's, it's overwhelming. So, um, but it's, it's working out for him. So it, it it didn't surprise you after the game Sunday, Jaden was out there shooting in Mackey Arena for at least not at all, not at all. This is an everyday thing. Not not at all. Just the uh, production that Sasha gave you guys, not from the three-point line, but his ability to attack the basket, how much did that keep you guys connected to Ohio State? Um, I mean, it's huge. You know, obviously, I know, uh, you know they, they have the game plan to kind of get Sasha off the line. You know, they, they know he's a really good shooter. So, um, for him to, you know, to drive the ball and make plays was huge for us. So, What kind of message did you guys send to the rest of the Big Ten tonight? Um, I mean, it's not necessarily a message. It's a, it's a message to ourselves. You know, we, we, prove, we prove something to ourselves every day. You know, we prove that we can compete. Um, you know, we prove that we can play hard when, when we play together. So um, it's more so to ourselves. So. Thank you. Thank you. Who else for Travion? I've got one real quick. Yep, go ahead. Uh, Travion, this is a team obviously loaded with youth. Um, obviously, this is a big moment for one of the younger guys on the team. Um, you guys have now won uh, four big games in a row. What's it say about the maturity uh, that this younger group has had uh, for your team? 
Um, you know, with everything going on in the world right now, man, um, you know, the best thing we did, you know, with our time is to stick together. Um, you know, if we have been together um, every day, we're in practice, we're, we're cheering each other on, you know, we're bringing energy. Um, and it just shows uh, on the court. You know, we, we took advantage of our time, you know, uh, with everything going on. So, obviously, you know, it's working out. Anyone else for Trey? Yeah, you had uh, – this is your 11th straight game scoring double figures. How much did it mean to you after starting off a little slow in foul trouble to get your rhythm and help your team get this win today? I mean, it was huge. You know, I knew coming in – I knew my time was coming, you know, in the second half. Obviously, I had two fouls, but uh, I knew everybody you know, was coming back in the game, so I knew when I came back in, you know, I had to kind of bring that boost, bring the energy, uh, kind of pick my team as well. Anyone else? Cool. All right, thank you, Trey.